Leon, it is one of the largest churches in the region, and it is going back to its roots. Today, the D.C. Superior Court reinstated the original board of trustees to Jericho City of Praise in Landover. That's that massive church right next to FedEx Field. Kevin Lewis is live there with new information in the case. Kevin? Hi there, Kimberly. This is just the latest twist in a long-standing religious squabble. A D.C. judge has ruled two former leaders at this megachurch were wrongly removed from their respective posts. And so, effective immediately, Pastor Joe Peebles, seen in this video, plus board member William Meadows, are allowed to return to the jobs they've been without since 2012. Of course, Peebles is the son of church founder Dr. Betty Peebles, who passed away in 2010. Following her death, a battle centered on who'd control this 100-acre church campus broke out and Peebles lost. Thousands of members followed the minister who went on to launch a mobile church. And today in a written statement, Peebles said he was grateful for and humbled by the court's ruling and added he will announce when and how he'll move to the next phase of restoration at the, quote, God-ordained time. All the while, the board that ousted Peebles isn't too thrilled. It told us by email, Jericho City of Praise strongly disagrees with the decision that goes against what the late apostle established and currently is appealing that order. As with every other decision rendered, we expect the District of Columbia Court of Appeals to overturn today's ruling and once again establish that Jericho City of Praise is and has always been properly governed. And so despite yet another court ruling here, this mega church remains sorely divided. Our live tonight in Landover, I'm Kevin Lewis, ABC 7 News.